हरे कृष्णा वी फील स्ट्रेस्ड नॉट सो मच बिकॉज वी आर ओवरवर्क एज बिकॉज वी आर ओवर वरीड स्ट्रेस इज अ कॉमन वाइड स्प्रेड ऑलमोस्ट यूनिवर्सल प्रॉब्लम इन टूडे सोसाइटी एस्पेशली मॉडर्न सोसाइटी एंड ऑफन वी फील दैट स्ट्रेस अराइज बिकॉज वी हैव सो मेनी थिंग्स टू डू एंड सो लिटिल टाइम टू डू इट इन Now that is one cause of stress, but we all humanity has always had a lot of things to do, and today we have machines which do a lot of work for us. So in the past people did not have that. So we it's not stress comes not just because we have so many things to do, but because our attitude towards those things becomes unhealthy. Stress comes when we worry too much when we are not so much because we are overworked but because we are over worried now worry is to some extent a una- natural unavoidable emotion because many things are not in our control and yet those things which are not in our control matter hugely to us so how do we deal with those things uh, we may worry about them however in every situation there are some things which you can think which are in our control and some things are not in our control so to over worry means to think so much about the things that are not in our control that we can no longer focus our energy and on doing the things that are in our control and that kind of obsession with the uncontrollable is characteristic of a diseased mind of a mind influenced by tamas the mode of ignorance krishna talks about this in the bhagavad gita in 18.35 when he says ya swapnam bhayam shokam vishadam madame vacha navimunchati durmedha dhruti sa partha tamasi so he lists various characteristics of a diseased mind day dreaming swapnam bhayam fearfulness which is worrying vishadam nam bhayam shok shokam lamentation oh so many things have gone wrong in my life vishad moroseness habitually looking at all the negatives in life madame vacha and then running away from all this through intoxication so when the uh, when the mode of ignorance tamas influence on us increases we worry excessively and if we want to overcome stress we may or may not be able to decrease our workload certainly we can try to manage uh, things more efficiently but even if we can't decrease our overwork we can surely decrease our over worry the more we become contemplative by studying the bhagavad gita and the more we become devoted by practicing the bhagavad gita's guideline to practice bhakti yoga then we rise from tamas to rajas to sattva and to shuddha sattva the more our consciousness becomes elevated the more we can focus constructively on the things in our control and the more we can let go of the things that are not in our control knowing that krishna is in control and thus as our worry decreases by our elevated consciousness we'll find our stress will also decrease thank you hare krishna